So before we get started, make sure you guys are going to check me out on all my social media platforms on Instagram, Twitter, and Snapchat. So I just got off work. Yet again, I'm a hardworking man. And I am going to show y'all how to make vegan chicken salad. I be tired, y'all. I be giving y'all the best that I got. You know what I'm saying? Give y'all the last little piece of my energy. Y'all don't appreciate me. So to get started, you're going to need a few ingredients. You may have in your refrigerator some things you may have to go get. So I have relish, a Mrs. Dash, of course, vegan mayonnaise, just a dash of lime juice, mustard, crushed um, red peppers, but you don't have to use it if this if you don't want to. That's some pepper. All right. So what's gonna take place of the um, chicken will be chickpeas, or some people like to call it garbanzo beans. So what I'm gonna do is just got them out of the can. I'm gonna rinse them off and Chickpeas to me are already kind of hard. So what I'm going to do is um, boil them a little bit. I'm going to boil them for maybe like five minutes, get them a little tender, and then put them in my food processor. So give me a quick second. So when you are making your chickpeas, let me tell you this, do not Go to the store and buy them in the bag. I am going to tell you this twice. Do not go buy them in the bag. You buy them in the bag, they're not gonna taste right. I soaked them, I boiled them, and I tried to make the um, vegan um, tuna salad because you use basically the same things to make the tuna salad. The only difference is you use a little, you can use a little seaweed. <clears throat> seaweed flakes and basically that will make them taste a little fishy but we're not doing that we're doing vegan um chicken salad all right so like i said i'm gonna boil them for five minutes and then i'm gonna come back and then i am going to drain them and then i'm gonna put them in my food processor so Give me a second, we'll be back. Thank you. 
this is what it looks like. Y'all can't tell me this don't look like chicken salad. So I used all of the ingredients. I used my lime juice. I used my Mrs. Dash. I used my crushed pepper. And I used my um, Dio Relish. And I used my pepper. Now what I will say is this. I cannot tell you how much to use and what to use because I eyeball it, but I'll try to put it in the description box of what you should use. Um, also, I did add onion in it and I used my food processor to put the chickpeas in and round them up and also my onions. And like I said in the other video, which you guys cannot see, Please do not run out and go get a full processor because you feel like you need one to be vegan. You don't, you can just crush them. You can use your blender if you need to. You do not need a full processor. That was just something I was doing because I was being extra and I felt like, hey, I saw everybody else had one and I wanted to see what it was like. So that's what I did, but this is the finished product. So what I'm gonna do now is try it. And once again, I will tell you guys, y'all, I do not, eat nasty vegan food or stuff that I don't like. So if I tell you it tastes good, it tastes good, okay? And once again, like I said, I boiled my chickpeas as well, so they kind of tender. So we gonna see what it tastes like, okay? Oh, and also, I use Ritz crackers. And if y'all didn't know, Ritz crackers are vegan. Y'all didn't know. Some of y'all been eating. Uh, some of y'all been eating vegan and all the time. Didn't know y'all was eating vegan stuff. Y'all been eating Oreos. Didn't know Oreos were vegan. Ritz crackers. If you like Ritz crackers, Ritz crackers are vegan. It's a lot of vegan stuff out here. They just don't see it. So we're gonna try. It. All right. Let me know what you think. Yo, when I tell you I gotta make myself stop eating this, what a leader say, let me know when you feel how I feel. Please follow it the exact way I told you to do it. Do not go get chickpeas in the bag, get the can, rinse them off, boil them, let them get tender, put all your ingredients in it. The ingredients I showed you earlier, if you're doing plant-based and you just don't want it and you want to use regular may mayonnaise, you can, but if you're vegan, you can use vegan eggs. Tastes like mayonnaise, can't tell the difference. Um, this is bomb, like. I wanna see what it's gonna taste like on bread. This is my bread. I think I showed this to y'all in another video. That bread right there can come, it, it costs from four to five dollars a loaf. And y'all can call me bougie if y'all want to. You don't have to buy that, that, that particular vegan bread. That's ridiculous. But I still buy it. And then let me tell you, it only lasts for a week. Who eat that much bread in a week? I don't eat sandwiches like that. Lies detected. Um, sandwich when I looked at you. The day I see you after I made you. I know that was a God. I knew that was a God. Like, 